nuan kula saya kerana mana mana dega nane ya sanji dega ya ya tami nade mana mana dega nane This isn't an Alfredi I've never seen Shahid Afridi do this in any form in any game. Well, he is so surprised. Why is he surprised for the loss of six wickets? That is the sixth wicket. You're going to watch Afridi out. That ball moved an absolute beauty. And Afridi absolutely surprised, shocked and stunned. Oh yes, you see why exactly the ball... making a difference here. Three runs started with a hundred, so he's in really good touch. Is that on the full? Is that carried? The Sri Lankans say yes. Hughes says very good bowling from Kulasekera. He's deserved this wicket, and another excellent catch from the skipper. Boy, he's taken some good catches on this tour. He's a very good batsman, but he's also an excellent slip fielder. Oh, that's cut. That seemed in a big off cut out. The Sri Lankans are saying it took the under edge as well. Is there a view on? Yes, there is. Richard Kettlebury didn't want Jay Warden at left hander. What sort of hot spot have we got? Oh, there's something there. Pretty convincing. David Hussey in trouble. The average of 43. He's going to need it all. Kula Sagra has got a shout. And he's been given. On Kula Sagra. He did. He spears running towards the stumps and swings back a bit. Clark wants to take him downtown. Done by a bit of swing. Excellent bowling, good pressure on both ends by the Sri Lankans. And Kula Saker has now got four for 16. A little bit of taping on the end of the index finger and he's out there. New batsman is Kula Saker. Well, that's flicked off the pads again, so he's he's been hit for quite a lot of boundaries in that area, Ben Hilfenhaus. Came at number eight today, but uh, was full delivery down leg side, picked it up beautifully between square leg and fine leg field, a couple of bounces into the fence. Yeah. He's cleared mid on, quite comfortably. I think he's got flipper, skipper and uh, Yorker, I think. And the, uh, the five that he's had in over a period of time. And this time he's cleared uh, mid off. So two good boundaries there from Kula Sacra. That's a top edge. There is a fine leg there. And Shane Watson drops it. And to add insult to injury, it's gone for four. Just couldn't judge it, Shane Watson. Had he caught it, I think the players out there would have been surprised because he just didn't pick this one. Very much within the boundary it was. You can see that he just hadn't got any control of the ball. It was always running away from him. Oh, that's a good hit. That's a belter. It's got for six. Kulasek was on fire. He's there in the team uh, for his bowling, but have a look at the shot. It's a tremendous hit. Christian. That's gone for four. Doesn't matter how they come. One is uh, ball will continue to remain hard. We're talking about two different balls from either end. He's got it through. It's gone for another boundary. Shane Watson dropped him. And he's pulled or dragged that one from outside the off stump. 
know the kind of power that he gets with these uh, on the up shots that he plays. Well done. That's a half century for Nuan Kulasekara. The Sri Lankan players in the dressing room all standing. Where's this gone? It's gone straight over. Extra cover. One bounce for four. And once again, maybe wet ball and the bowler struggling to get the Yorkers in. Maybe it's the pressure adding to the damn ball in the hand. He's going for the big shot, and has he got another one? He has, it's another six. The bat for Kulasekra. But look at the welcome he's given David Hussey. That's a lot, that 